Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Brian Navichoke Cabello, and I am a realtor associated with Keller Williams Realty in Fayetteville, North Carolina. And I'm also the host of The Local Historian. And on today's episode, we're going to be discussing the Coca-Cola Go signs that are scattered throughout Sanford, North Carolina. Now, before we can get started with the historic marketing campaign of these carbonated beverages, we must first find their origin, which is conveniently located in Sanford. The very first soda manufacturer in town was created by J.R. Ingram and was dubbed Sanford Carbonating Works, being established on Charlotte Avenue in 1905. In later years, the company was sold off and had its name changed to Sanford Coca-Cola Bottling Company, where it also moved locations from Charlotte Avenue to Hawkins Avenue. Now, without further ado, I think it's time for us to go ghost sign hunting. Now, as you can see from the video, I'm clearly struggling to find this ghost sign. Luckily, however, my wonderful fiance was able to capture a really good scene where you can clearly see the Coca-Cola Go sign depicted right above Sanford's own Temple Theater. Now moving along in our hunt for the Coca-Cola Go signs in Sanford, North Carolina, we actually revisit the fabulous Hudson Hornet from the previous episode of The Local Historian, where right across from it we can see this lovely Go sign that's been restored. Now for our third and final Coca-Cola Go sign located in Sanford, North Carolina, we come walking down the street of Still Street, where I stumble across the spooky and true to its name, Go sign of Coca-Cola. Whoa, that might have been a little too scary for me. But at the end of the day, I think all these Go signs came out great. And I'd like to give a special shout out to Scott Nurkin from The Mural Shop. Thank you, Scott, for redoing all of these Go signs in town. I'd also like to give special thanks to the Sanford Coca-Cola Bottling Company for sponsoring these projects. Thank you guys. Well, now that was a fun way to spend the morning, afternoon, or evening in Sanford, North Carolina. If you guys are ever in the search for something to do, always make sure to just walk around. You never know what you might stumble upon this nice historic city. I've been your host, Brian Navachuka Cabello, realtor associated with Keller Williams Realty in Fayetteville, North Carolina, and the host of The Local Historian. I'll see you guys next time.